This machine is called the Bell Potter. Like many of the 3D printers of its generation, it was conceived for the field of tissue engineering, which is currently trying to find out, for example, how to print a kidney or a liver or a heart. But as engineering is wide reaching, we decided to, to turn it into a, a 3D chocolate printer. Uh, we wanted to get closer to people and uh, to the eagerness of uh, eating chocolate, of course. First, you have to design your chocolate structure on free software. Uh, you can make a simple chocolate structure, like chocolate cylinders, but also a more complex one, like chocolate turtles or whatever you like. Uh, once your chocolate design is completed, the software will then slice it into uh, horizontal chocolate layers, and then the chocolate printer will uh, print the layers on top of each other, giving shape to the 3D object. Chocolate is melted and stocked in a syringe. As chocolate makes its way through with pressure, the head of the machine draws the chocolate layer. Within a few minutes, the chocolate structure will be completed and ready to eat. This kind of technology could soon be in anybody's home and for a reasonable price. There are a lot of possibilities with this machine, limited only by the customer's imagination. You could print all that you design in chocolate, of course, but uh, also other things like printed plastic toys, Printed electronic devices, printed cheese, pizzas, printed ice creams, just whatever you want. <laughs>